Good morning, welcome to today's video. I'm excited, finally vlogging. It's been a second since I've just kind of shared a very real look into our life and just like taking you guys along with us on our date. So welcome, I hope you're just as excited as I am about another vlog. I feel like I'm going to love looking back on these as Sammy grows older because I, it helps me kind of capture just like everyday moments. So we've just been hanging out this morning. I just keep looking over here because that's where she is. She's just chilling. Are you chilling? But we just have nothing planned for today. So it's gonna be a just stay home, relax, maybe get a couple um, chores and stuff done. But yeah, nothing crazy planned. Just wanted to share a very real day in our life. One thing I've been really striving to do is to get myself ready. One minute, I'm just gonna <laughs> turn this off. <laughs> One thing I've been trying to do is I've been really striving to get ready every day, even if it's super simple. Like today I put like BB cream on and just like a tiny bit of makeup, straightened my hair a little bit, just something. Do you want to say hello? It just helps me feel better, more productive, um, and that's important. So, okay, also we have a biter. Yeah. Do you like to bite? What are you doing? <laughs> she has discovered how to bite really hard and how to grind her teeth. So that's what we're dealing with on a daily basis, but that's okay. It's so fun having a seven month old with six teeth. Rodolfo and I have been really into juicing lately. I feel like it's such a great way to force myself to eat certain vegetables that I don't like because they're disguised in a yummy juice. Obviously, it's not like the best way to eat your vegetables because it gets rid of a lot of the fiber, um, but the juicer we have is pretty good and it does um, retain quite a bit of it. But it's been a really great way to have like a healthy juice to start our mornings off. So every single morning we both have like a glass of this juice. So I like to make orange juice. Rodolfo hates oranges, like hates oranges. So. I like to make myself an orange juice to have um, that I just sip on throughout the week or whatever. It's so good. Um, and then we make another one that's a bit more vegetable-y. So I put carrots, apples, I put peppers, um, kale, and ginger goes in that one as well. Ginger is so good for you. I don't personally really like ginger though, so I find, again, juicing it. Juicing is such a great way for me to just disguise vegetables I don't like. Like I don't like peppers, but when they're thrown in a juice, you can't taste them as much. But I find if you do more apples and carrots, 
those can help to hide some of the other things that you might throw in there. So we just mix it up every week. We throw in random stuff, but that's been a really great thing for us to just stay on top of our health and just starting the morning off right. Um, and yeah, I don't know. It's just a really easy way for us to change up one thing instead of getting processed juices or juices that are loaded with obviously like sweeteners and sugars. Yes, this is natural sugar and it's still very sweet, um, but I just like knowing that it's homemade and it's just a lot better for us. So it's just one little thing that we've been doing. Okay, I'm so impatient. I want to move this like dresser thing. Um, it was in the dining room, it looked cute, but I just, I want it to look way less cluttered in here and this is just not working for me. So I wanna move it into the kitchen, but I'm too impatient to wait for Rodolfo to get home, what's new? So I came up with this genius idea because this does scratch the floor, but it's way too heavy for me to like lift by myself. I put a towel down, so now I can drag it and it will not scratch. I'm feeling very genius. Maybe that's an obvious thing, but that was harder than it actually looked to do. <laughs> She had a really good nap, actually. That was like an hour. You slept for like an hour this morning. Thank you, you gave mommy so much time. <laughs> down for her afternoon nap nap times look different for me every single day um if i feel like i need it i nap with her and i i do that a lot actually um i'll often take at least one nap with her some days i will take every nap with her i really just try and um 
do what I feel like my body needs that day. Today I'm feeling pretty good actually. Um, so I don't really want to sleep. Um, I have stuff I want to get done. So it was really nice. I was able to get chili cooking for tonight. I finally learned how to use our slow cooker and it's been a game changer. So yeah, I'm <laughs> making chili. It's really nice because I can make it now and then just set it on there for like five hours and it'll be ready to go by the time Rodolfo gets home from work. Um, and then I just do any cleaning I needed to get done. But every single day looks different and I think as moms it's just really important to give ourselves grace and to um, treat every day differently. Don't, don't set crazy expectations for yourself. Um, I try and have a couple things I know I want to get done for today I obviously want to vlog so I'm now going to edit start editing this video um, I also knew that the bathroom needed to be cleaned so I did that and I just set little things throughout my day and then anything else I do is kind of bonus um, and then there's days where I get no nothing like no chores done um, but that's okay too because some days I I need to take it easy in order to be the best version of myself for Samantha and that's really my number one priority so yeah I don't know every nap time looks different but today I actually did feel like getting some stuff done so it's been kind of nice and she's actually been taking really regular naps which has been super great so I'm just gonna enjoy this quiet time and I'll catch up with you guys later. <laughs> This is how I'm keeping Samantha entertained so I can do the dishes and finish getting dinner ready. My chair comes in very handy. kitchen is clean I love nights like this and that's why I love the slow cooker because dinner I already was able to clean up all of the like fake dishes from cooking dinner and now it'll just be the dishes that we eat with that we'll have to clean up after so it's really nice but thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video I really liked picking up the camera and just vlogging a daily life again it's really fun yeah was it fun it was just a very real day in our life, but I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you, <laughs> if you did enjoy today's video, I would love if you guys would 
give the video a thumbs up. And if you're new here and you liked this video, take a look around my channel. And if you like what you see, would love to have you subscribe. <laughs> All right, well, I guess that's our cue. We will see you guys next time. Go say bye. Okay.